Okay, here we go. This is second round. This is uh this is a failure video failure video. Okay, let's see. Crazy Man One, I'm watching your video as we speak. I am in the middle of it. The Chevelle wagon is complete. Oh my gosh, I have one thing I wanna give you. Right here. Bravo, my friend. Oh my gosh. I've never uh, uh that's amazing, okay? I, I'm speechless. Um <coughs> it's just amazing. Okay. Moving on. I do not want to rush this quiz, man. Believe me, it is awesome, but I gotta hurry this along because I have not got time to waste. Here we go. Chevy Silver Out, I told you guys about it. I have a lift kit. I found wheels. Yes, I found wheels from a Hummer H2. They are Hummer H2 rims inside these big monstrous climbing wheels. They're great. It fits. I, I don't know if... The, I think... I'm pretty sure the, the wheels, the tires fit, but I think the wheel and the... um where the pin goes, that's going to be a little bit of a problem, but I can shave it down and all that stuff. Um, as you can see, I have been painting and painting and painting. I have a headache right now. I have been painting since Monday. It is now Thursday. I'm going to be staying up as late as I can tonight. So if there's anybody staying up late, um, you know, just send me a message and maybe we can get some numbers. I can, um, maybe we can talk on the phone, something like that. I don't know. Um, just hit me a message. Maybe we can chat in our chat room somewhere. I don't freaking know. I'm just... I'm really bored sitting in my basement listening to the radio and doing this. So, help me out. That'd be awesome. Uh, well, not help me out. Just send me a message. It'd be kind of fun. Um, hit me up. Be fun. Um, okay. Chevy Silverado. Okay. So, that's... Holy crap. I've been running through this video quicker than something. If you guys can't understand me, I'll remake this video when I'm not busy. There you go, ginger ale. It's all we got, but I'm drinking it. Um, catch my breath. Okay, this Sunday, this Sunday, this coming Sunday, the 7th, my sister's birthday, I am going to the Bloomington, Minnesota, NNL um, North... I think it's their national or 11th or 13th annual model car show. I'm not just going. I'm going and I'm entering. But I need prayers from you guys and I need some good luck. I need some wishes. Um, you know, I, I got to finish this pickup, this Chevy Silverado, and I got to finish my Camaro. Okay, my Camaro though. My Camaro is another story. Let me tell you that. Okay, Camaro. I'm really sad for the Camaro right now because as you can see, Okay, look at the shine compared. Shine, dull shine. Okay, this feels like an orange peel. We all know what orange peel is. This is not orange peel. It feels like orange peel, though. Um, this may be orange peel, what orange peel really is. But I was told orange peel was the little dots you get at the end of paint. Uh, none of those that I can see... No, I have none of those in the paint. It's just the paint feels like orange peel. And I have a few things in it. But you know what? Underneath them lights, it's going to look like crap. But you know what? I'm going for craziest engine. They don't have a craziest engine section, but whatever. It's craziest engine. Look this up. If anybody, you can click your tab. Look up 2JZ. Excuse me there. I'm sorry. Look up 2JZ. A number 2 with a J and then a Z. What is a 2JZ? If you know engine codes like I do, a 2JZ is a Toyota Supra engine. Now you're thinking, oh my gosh, what's a Toyota Supra? Okay, Toyota Supra is a Japanese car. Okay, now some of you may be ready to slap me across the face because you're thinking, okay, you're going to put a Japanese engine in a American car. Okay, I may um, be crazy, but I'm not the first one to do it. I'm the I I am the only, I'm the second person to ever do it, whether that be in real life or plastic. I'm the only person to ever attempt. But um, <laughs> um, more about the Chevy Silverado. I'm putting a turbocharger on here. Okay, I built I scratch built an intercooler. Pain in the butt. I have a headache right now. My parents are gone. They're off some town with my sister. Hopefully they bring me. I think they're bringing me back some food. Maybe that will get help get rid of the headache. I haven't eaten nothing all day. Now I'm just babbling on. You guys don't want to hear what I'm talking about. Um, please work, computer. 
But um, yeah, I'm putting that not monstrous, not ginormous, but bigger size turbo compared to what you would see on like a Duramax or Duramax, whatever Duramax Chevy Silverado diesel power um, uh, turbo diesel. You wouldn't see this on there because this is a gasoline powered turboed. It's gonna be crazy. But um. So, some of you may think, Chase, you're crazy, or Bass Champ 101, you're crazy for trying to put this in here. Oh, I'm crazy, huh? You check out this video I'm going to show you. Um, for the Silverado, you all know, um, if you've built this kit, the, um, Chevy Silverado has a fan for the cooling and stuff. It has a fan. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm just not going to put the fan on there. I'm going to use this. Uh... I, I don't remember. I think this is a radiator along with, um, you know what? Who cares? It's a radiator. It's going to be a radiator slash, um, cooler for your, um, oh yeah, that's what it is. The fan there is for the AC and stuff and the, um, that's the radiator behind it. Now I see. I was getting a little mentally retarded there. I'm sorry. But for all of you that can check out my videos please check out my favorites because this car is in there and you may be thinking I'm crazy but watch this video my friends is the sound of a single turbo 2JZ Chevy Camaro 1000 plus horsepower. That is what my model car is going to be. You hear me? I mean, wow. Listen to this car. It's just bad. Bad with the A word. I'm not, I don't want to swear, but it's just badass, you know what I mean? <laughs> okay, here we go. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, there you go. There's a little taste of what I'm trying to uh, make. If I could connect really loud speakers to this thing, I would, I would, I would make it uh, the sound play continuously through the thing. Press me, press a button. It wouldn't be continuous. You just press the button, and it, it makes that you know the whole sound. Yeah, I maybe sound like a retard. Got a headache, and ugh, it's just ugh. I've been painting all day. I mean, all week. I mean, custom. It's uh, that that uh, Camaro's gonna be custom because I mean I got the Supra engine. I have uh, Toyota Supra dash interior, the seats, the works, blah blah blah. Um, I'm just gonna ask everybody, fast Jimmy, everybody, if you guys could make me a video, okay? I'm gonna t I'm gonna sh I'm gonna tell you why. Everybody's been making videos for everybody, but I just want to know. Okay, this is just me. I'm going to show you, okay? Now, the interior, let's say this This is the interior, okay? The interior of the car. You cut the door open, and now you got the interior, You got you, but you got to get a gap, okay? You have your hinges made, everything's ready, but you do not know how to fill in that gap. I have the styrene and stuff, but I've tri I tried an hour the first time I got my stuff. I wasted two sheets of styrene trying to get it to work. Styrene, styrene, uh, yeah, styrene, styrene, whatever, it's all plastic crap. Yeah, I, as you can tell, I'm ir irritated. I've been going to bed like 1 o'clock every, every day trying to get this stuff done. Um. So, I just want to know, you guys, how can you fill that in? I mean, I know, I think that Jimmy, you used, like, a uh, putty one time, I think I saw. Uh, but, how do you do it with your, like, how do you measure it out? How do you, um, do that? Because uh, in your video for how to make hinges, you didn't really, no offense, but you didn't really go into that. Well, now you just said, do your other stuff. And, yeah, so if you could do that, that'd be awesome. So, for the show, you guys, please pray... Pray for the fact that I get these two cars done.
that they're done and over with before we leave on Saturday morning, okay? We're going to leave early, so please pray that I get them done. They're good quality. They're really cool. And, um, yeah, so please pray that I get a good place. I mean, I, I, I get some stuff at the, at the show. And, um, thanks, and I'll see you later. God bless you guys. Peace. Oh, and by the way, if anybody wants to talk, call me, chat, talk, whatever, send me a message, and yeah, see ya.